started at this Manhattan fertility clinic last April when two women, one black, the other white, both struggling to get pregnant, had appointments to be implanted with their own eggs fertilized by their husbands. It's a widely practiced and relatively simple procedure, but that day, according to lawyers representing Deborah Perry Rogers and Donna Fasano, something went wrong. During the implantation procedure, there was some confusion in the room, and that inadvertently three eggs of Mrs. Rogers that was to be discarded were placed in, in Ms. Fasano. The mistake meant that Donna Fasano carried both Ms. Rogers' child and her own and gave birth to twins, one black, one white, now three months old. In a heartbreaking decision captured in this simple handwritten statement, Fasano agreed this week to give the black baby to the Rogers. We both want what's in the best interest of the child, she wrote. She loves this boy. She doesn't look at this boy as white or black. This is her son, and she wants the boy to grow up to know she carried the baby. The two families and their attorneys have now joined to sue the doctors at the clinic, who had no comment. Medical ethicists say this rare case is a reminder that even the marvels of technology are susceptible to human error. People should understand that when they get involved in this kind of reproductive medicine, this kind of thing can happen and people should go into it with their eyes open. The mothers plan to meet soon and have promised to let the boys get to know each other as they grow up. Brothers, part of one big family born out of the perils of technology. Elizabeth Kaladin, CBS News, New York.